Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Let's Play Clue, or Cluedo if you're from the UK. And I would like to apologize if I sound a bit off today. I was not having a great day. So, I'm trying my best to cheer, my, cheer myself up. And it's not that easy. Um, but in today's, um, in today's uh, Let's Play video, we're down to two themes of the board. Which I'm not going to tell you the last one, but like I stated in the last Let's Play, we're going to go to Egyptian Adventure. And it features six characters. We have Scarlet, who sort of um, is, um, I don't know how, I don't know how to describe her. Seems like she's uh, the kind of lady that drives, uh, well, not, well, not drive, but technically flies a certain type of plane. I forgot what kind of plane it is. It could be a helicopter or something that resembles a, I, I forgot the name of the lady that, that was the first woman that flies uh, a certain type of plane, because it's been a while since I learned anything about history. But we got Scarlet, we got Plum, we got Peacock, we also got Mustard with his uh, bird, we got Green, who's probably an adventurer, and we got another character named Metal Brook, which I'm going to be playing as her, because she is a new character. And she almost resembles to Peacock, but her name is Metal... I think it's Met Meadow Brook, or Metal Brook. I her Metal Brook, but, but it sounds like I'm using it with an L. <laughs> My apologies, though. It is very hard to pronounce certain names or words, even if some are very easy, but it's very difficult to pronounce because it sounded, like, very di different. So I'm removing all the characters, the clue characters from Sherlock, and we're going to put some uh, clue characters from the Egyptian Adventure. Alright, so it looks like all the characters from the Egyptian Adventure are now set to play, and here we go. We finally... You finally get to see a little bit of the animation of this, this time. And it looks absolutely amazing. Yes. Okay. Let's see... If we could, uh... Whoops! Sorry. Uh... <laughs> I was watching a YouTube video while it was loading. Oh, it looks like it's my turn. Awesome. So the, so the cards that I have is two weapon cards and one room card. So I think we need to focus on getting the suspects. Okay, so where am I going? I need to go to the space. And I accidentally, um, and as for me, I was waiting to get this you uh, to get this game load, and then, and then I pressed the wrong button on my phone. Well, technically not the wrong button, because what I was trying to do is to have this phone turn on a little bit longer, so that I could be able to finish uh, playing this Let's Play game. But... We're definitely down to one more th uh, board to go, but for the time being, we must focus. So, let's start off with Peacock with this weapon. What was she wearing on top? <gasps> right out the bat, it was definitely Mrs. Peacock. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is absolutely an amazing video already. This is an amazing video. Alright. So now that we know uh, who did it, we gotta figure out which weapon and which room. So everyone could not disprove the suggestion that Mrs. Peacock did it. Because no one has that uh, suspect card. And it looks like Plum is headed to the temple. This is 
has already become an amazing video since I, um, since I suggest that Peacock did it, and right out the bat, no one has the Peacock suspect card. I know that this is not the weapon, which is why I'm probably going to be focused on the weapon as the second major thing. So you're probably wondering why why am I in a very terrible mood? But let's just say um, I forgot. Let's just say in the past. Um, I was trying to get this this clue game at Walmart, and they didn't have it in stores, so I had to order it online. And that was uh, like last Saturday, in case you're wondering. I will not say too much about it because it's like, what happens happens. But you're probably wondering, did I manage to get it? Well, I cannot say nor spoil any details, but for the time to, for the time being, I'm just going to say that I am getting close of getting that game. Because I really wanted it because the, the game that I wanted is like an escape game that's called Clue, and it's, it's not very extremely old. But they do manage to get brand new ones, brand new sequels of ones, like the museum one. Which I don't know is already available, but all I know is that I'm getting the one that is like the Tudor Mansion one. Like Treasury of the Tudor Mansion is exactly what it's called. But I will not ramble too much any further about that. <gasps> Alright, so the weapon that I'm going to choose could be this one. Let's see. Okay, so it's not the Spectre. I, have to s I wanted to say that I'm disappointed, but at the same time I'm not, because at least I know that Miss the uh, Peacock did it. Which I I certainly cannot believe I got Peacock <gasps> as the suspect right away. That is totally awesome. Also, I was feeling a little bit, uh, exhausted ever since, ever since. So that's why I'm not much of a great mood, but the fact that I real, the fact that I got Peacock as the one suspect that did it, it's like, wow. Wow. Okay, so let me see here. So, Scarlet does not have the air strip, but there's a possibility she has this and or this. We don't know for certain, but that is Plum's suggestion. Now it's time for Peacock. Okay, so Green doesn't have his own card. The Spectre is Mustard's card, so that means that the boat is not where the room takes place. It has to be because Mustard has um, Mustard has um, the, the, the weapon card, which is this one, and and Mr. Green doesn't have his own card, which is. This one right here. So it definitely confirms that he has the boat. As you can tell, I'm starting to... Putting these pieces together. If I figure out the weapon... If I figure out the weapon, then I'll figure out the room. But once I figure out the room... It'll be over.
Looks like green is staying in the temple. Just that it wasn't plum. Let's see. Ooh, I rolled a three. That's not good. That's not good at all. And the reason why I said because I'm not going to be able to make a suggestion. So it looks like I have to wait for my next turn. Mustard is headed to the oasis as he hmm? suggests it was him with the pistol. Let's see here. Um, I know it's not that weapon. Plum may have this card. We'll just have to wait and see. Also, I'm trying to keep, keep it together. I can't even talk. I also try to keep it together. So I wasn't trying to be salty. I wasn't trying to be salty about the, uh, you know. Looks like Plum is to notice that this is the peacock did it. And also Plum may have the temple, but, but we don't know which one. I don't know. Hmm. But I need to figure out the weapon though. That's the main, that's the one thing that I need to figure it out. Carla is head to the boat with a lot of people, and the people are now gone because of... I love the fact that Green is wearing a hat while he's trying to, you know... I think that's Mr. Body, but it could be a uh, Dr. Uh, Ebony, or... Oh my goodness. I have no words at this time. Uh. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, right now is my turn. Let's head to the Sphinx again. Hold on for a second. Okay, sorry about that. I have to take care of a few things. Well, not a few things, but just a small thing. Um... Oh yeah. As I was saying, um, is, um, let's try this. Oh, okay, so this onk isn't the weapon. So we're down to two weapons, which is the pickaxe and the dagger. It looks like mother... <gasps> mother, what am I saying? I'm trying to say mustard. Oh my goodness. But it looks like he's headed to the tomb to suggest that it was Scarlet. But the Ankh wasn't the weapon. Because Scarlet has that card. The weapon card. Lum is also headed to the tombs. <gasps> he suggests that it was me as Metal Brook with the dagger. And of course, Peacock disapproved this suggestion. She doesn't have, uh, the tune card. Um, she could have both of these cards. I'm not certain. But I definitely know that she was the killer. Just right now I gotta figure out the weapon, and 
and um, <gasps> and the room itself. This is not the room. Okay, so one may have him and the no no no. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to put a question mark because I don't know if he has it. And I don't know if he also has the temple as well. That's where it gets a very complicated. I think it's only a matter of time for me to figure out the rules as well. So we'll just have to wait and see. Alright. That's a six. Ugh. Man, I really want to go to the Sphinx, but it looks like I have to go to the temple. I'll go to the temple just to see here. Alright. <gasps> oh, okay. So the dagger is in one of the weapons. So this confirms that the murder weapon is the pickaxe. So with that. Okay, so we got our weapon and now we just need to figure out one thing. Which is the room. Something tells me it could have been temple. I know now that Mustard has the weapon card, and I have the suspect card. Which means that Scarlet has the room card, and it's the tent. So, so far, the tent is not where it takes not where the murder takes place. See, he, uh, green doesn't have the airstrip, and I have the weapon card, which I can't pronounce the name of it. So that means that mustard is the suspect card is mustard that he has. All right, so far so good. I just gotta figure out the room first. Not the room first. I just gotta figure out the room. You see, Green is wearing a hat like he's trying to prevent a being revealed as the killer, but I know that he's not. Huh? This game was pretty cool. Regardless. Look at that eagle. Look at that eagle. So, let's see. Mustard has the Spectre card. And Green has... Mustard card. But, the problem is that I don't know if he has the waterfall card as well. Excuse me. My apologies. I'm feeling very... You know. I almost feel very sleepy. But it's like... Huh? You're feeling completely drained, even though... There are certain times you feel like... You haven't done anything, but you feel drained either way. Hmm. Okay. 
<laughs> we still have not figured out. Let's see, what kind of roll do I get? Oh, great. I'm not going to be able to... I'm not going to be able to get to the spade. No, not the spade, so... Um, I almost forgot. The objective is to figure out uh, the risk. Let's use this. One. Okay, so the tomb isn't where it takes place. Now this is where it gets stressful because the AI is is uh, because all five of the AI characters are are all in easy right now. If you haven't seen. Yep, green has the bow. As far as whoever has scarlet, it could have been mustard or green. But the purpose is uh, for right now is that I'm trying to figure out the runes and not the suspects nor the weapon. Because we already established that, you know. Okay, so Peacock doesn't have scarlet. And no one has the pickaxe. So this definitely confirms that no no no. This definitely confirms that the market is not where it takes place. It's not where it takes place. And neither is the tomb. Huh? doesn't help but we're definitely getting close to the end of this let's play once we're done with this we only have one more board to go <gasps> and then we're going to the bonus uh, round or the bonus gameplay or the bonus let's play which is technically just technically to play the international character and once we're done with that... Oh, great. So I'm unable to make it to the temple. Because they put me into the airstrip. Someone suggests that I did it, but it's not. So now I just gotta figure this out. <gasps> I mean, but I know it's Peacock, and I know the weapon, but I want to mix it up just to get them a little bit confused. And of course, Mom has the Oasis card. So we're down to three rooms at this time. Which I have to pay very close attention to my notes, because I might miss it if I get it wrong. Looks like Mustard is headed to the waterfalls. So Plum did not have himself. And I have this card. The weapon card. So that means that Peacock has the waterfall room. So we're down to two rooms right now. Just the temple and the air tube. And I have a feeling that it could have been the temple. Because that's the only room that I don't know if anyone has. Alright, so once we 
figure it out once we try to get to the temple, which is my main goal here. I need to get a higher roll just to get to the temple. Unless someone suggests that it was me as Metal Bro that did it, which it wasn't. Because I already figured it out with these two clues here. I need to get a higher roll just to get to the temple. That's something that needs to be accomplished. Because otherwise, if I don't, then this could be a problem. This could be a problem. Although I would choose the airstrip if I roll something that is not as big. Because it's closer to the oasis room. Alright, I need a higher roll just to get to the temple. And unfortunately, unfortunately, I did not make to any of these rooms at all. So now this is where it gets a little bit stressful because now I'm stuck. No, I'm, I'm not going to make my pilot accusation. I know the Sphinx is in the room because I have that room card. <gasps> Oh, interesting. So let's see. No one has the pickaxe. I have the room called the Sphinx, which definitely confirms that Peacock definitely has, like, uh, me as Metal Brook, which is played by me. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, and it looks like Green has Scarlet as well. Because remember, no one has Peacock. So, two suspects that has not been named as the killer, but I do know for certain. I do know for certain that Peacock did it with the pickaxe. The question is which room? That's the only problem. But now this is where it gets a bit difficult because they... Because... Who, I forgot who suggested me as the killer. And by that I meant uh, me playing as Metal Brook. Who suggested me did it with the pickaxe in the Sphinx? It's just like, all right. Oh. <gasps> Wait a minute. Something is is in the off. Huh? Something's a little bit off here. Something is a little bit off. Oh my goodness, something is a little bit off, because I wasn't paying attention. I was not paying attention. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Are you telling me that all this time it was the wolf? Waterfall? I, th I thought the waterfall wasn't the, the room that took place. I'm getting very confused here. I'm getting very confused here. I'm going to stay in the water waterfall right now because I need to know... Because I need to know exactly if this is where the room takes place because I don't want to get it mixed up. So, the temple was given by Plum, and whoever has the airstrip could have been Plum or Mustard. Either way, I think we figured this out. My final accusation, ladies and gentlemen. It was Mrs. Peacock. With the pickaxe. In the water. It's a little bit stressful. It was the waterfalls. It was the pickaxe. But as the suspect, it was indeed Mrs. Peacock. Well, technically Peacock. Da -da 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 and 
whatever that accessory is, it fell off. Mm -hmm. So it took me 9 turns, and time is 13 minutes and 40 seconds. So next time on Let's Play Clue, we're going to head into the final, final board. Which is, I forgot the name of this, uh, of this last board. Um, I think it has something to do with Tropical. Oh yes, it's called Tropical Mystery. Which is one of my favorite, um, boards. Technically, technically it's my favorite board, but also has one of my favorite musics of all time. So, yeah, I, I mentioned about that. Uh, I, I, I have no words, but it looks like I already said what I said. And also, let's just go ahead and cross that out. And we don't know who had the airstrip, but it doesn't matter, because that is the end of this LP. Thanks for watching, and as always, stay safe, stay healthy, be kind to others, and more importantly, have a wonderful day.